Hello, welcome to this video and on this video you're going to be seeing a very rare charity signal that I've just made with my friend Pam here. Just finished it off off the plate, you're going to see it in a minute. So Pam is a musician, she's one of my students, she's also, uh, do you want to say hello Pam? Hello. <laughs> she's also one of my patrons and she's come over and said could you do something for the horse charity that I work for? So I've, I've now made a a charity single unlike anything you've ever heard before. Can you tell them a little bit about the charity? Um, it's the Healing Horse Sanctuary. They're home to, I forget how many horses now, but quite a few horses in Bromsgrove. Um, they also rescue chickens and there's a few feral cats I believe. And there's a particular fundraising campaign going on at the moment um, as they're having to prematurely move out of a shop that they were offered in Bromsgrove. It's been a fabulous shop, fantastic opportunity, but sort of without notice they're suddenly having to move out um, and it takes well over £3,000 a month to fund the charity to feed the horses, vet bills, rent so we're, I'd like to help with the campaign just to help with the immediate funding so that they're not at risk of... Yeah so it's quite an emergency which is why Pam came to see me is there anything you could do and I cooked up this idea of trying to do a charity single, especially after my video on Live Aid. So this is like a little mini Andy Edwards Live Aid here. So the uh, the link is in the description and it's on screen. And now you're going to hear my um, and see my very special uh, charity single, which is called Horsey Horsey Gallop Away. Okay. okay. Pa Pam's aware that I've just made that title up on the spur of the moment. <laughs> it's a good title. Horsey Horsey Gallop <laughs> Away, available on, on all platforms but mainly here, fits and well, only yeah. here. <laughs> I've heard a preview, it fits well. Yeah. Yes, okay, thank you for watching, and go and stick lots of money in the link down below. Come on, you you selfish people. Hoarding it all, you're hoarding it all. There's poor horses that have got a shop to go to, and poor chickens that will have to be slaughtered, won't they? Will they well, be slaughtered? possibly. You yeah, know, we, yeah, the, the, you know yeah. and the thing is, is if, if there's no one rescue, I mean, I mean, chickens usually are slaughtered anyway. I mean, what do they do once they've rescued these chickens? They they live out a peaceful life and get pampered. See, if you want to see pampered chickens living out the rest of their life, instead of becoming Sunday dinner for somebody, you need to put some money in. And if you don't, that will be on your um, what, conscience, isn't it? The conscience. <laughs> it'll be on your conscience. That's what'll happen. Oh, you, you know, you've got to put some in, haven't you? Go on, have you done it? Go and do it now. Okay, here's my lovely charity single, which is called, what was it called? Horsey, horsey, gallop, run away. I've forgotten already. It's Talk horsey, horsey, that. gallop, run away. Here it is. And uh, thanks, Pam, for coming and giving me the chance to do this charity goodness. My, my feel <laughs> like I'm a better person now for helping the horses and the chickens. And that's very important to me. So put some money in now. Now! <laughs>
So I hope you enjoyed that tune, Horsey Horsey Gallop Away. Um, and I hope you um, appreciated all the um, uh, costume work I'd done and the theatrics. So um, if you're still here watching and you've enjoyed it, just remember the enjoyment you've had then. And you really should be funding that enjoyment in some way. So put some money in the charity now. Do it now.